Hey, what's going on everyone? This is ID Views back with another video and today I will show you guys how you can fix the unable to download error on your iPhone. I have seen a lot of people report this problem when they are not able to download apps from the App Store. Apps get stuck, they don't download at all or anything like that. So here are a few simple tricks that you can use in order to fix that error. Now the first thing you want to try is very very simple. If the app already shows on the home screen but it's stuck, it doesn't load, just go ahead and tap on the icon once and it should start loading. Again, if, if, if it shows the icon on the home screen, just try tapping on it, it might start loading. One of the most effective ways to fix this problem is signing out from the App Store. Just make sure you close the App Store app from the background, then go to settings, go to iTunes and App Store, go to your Apple ID right there and tap sign out right here and sign out from your Apple ID and then just go back and sign in once again. Also make sure you don't have any restrictions enabled. So just go to settings, go to screen time and go right here to content and privacy restrictions and from here just make sure this if this is enabled just go ahead and go to itunes and app store purchases and just go ahead and allow installing apps right there because you might have this and don't allow not being able to download apps also might have something to do with your Wi-Fi. So what you want to do is go to settings, go to Wi-Fi, select your Wi-Fi network, the Wi-Fi network that you're currently connected on, tap the little I dot on the name of the Wi-Fi network and just go ahead and tap right here on renew lease. And of course, always make sure that you have the time set to automatic. Now App Store won't work if the time is not correct. So go to settings, go to general, go to time and date and make sure you have it set on automatic. There are a few things that you can reset within the settings that might help you with this problem. So go to settings, go to general and scroll all the way down here and go to reset. From here, you can reset the network settings. Just keep in mind that this will reset your network settings, which means that it will delete all the saved Wi-Fi passcodes that you have on your device. If that doesn't work, you can go ahead and reset all the settings of your device and hopefully that will work. Keep in mind that that will reset all the settings to their factory default. So that is it for this video guys. These are some tips that hopefully will help you fix this problem if you have it on your device. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go ahead and subscribe for more and I'll see you on the next one.